So I am the DJ in the locker room. You can't play the game before the game, you know. Ich mache mir Gedanken über das Spiel, über den Gegner. Definitely, I have to have a nap. Yes, always. <laughs> yeah. I feel like it's a good way to just rest your body. No, I don't have it. Je nach Spiel oder Anschlusszeit kommt immer darauf an, wann das Spiel ist. Ich glaube, wenn wir 17.30 Uhr dann vielleicht 21 Uhr oder 20.30 Uhr spielen, dann auf jeden Fall. Nothing really special, just water. A lot of water. Zu trinken brauche ich Wasser. Carbs, like spaghetti, rice, uh, meat, chicken. Every day I drink uh, herba mate, it's like a South American tea. Pasta mit Bolognese and uh, with chicken. I always eat some kind of fish or, or chicken and, and pasta, rice. Kohlenhydrate, also entweder Nudeln oder Kartoffeln voll. Meistens esse ich paar Pesto Nudeln. Nichts Wildes, Pasta, Milchreis. Just listen to music. I try to listen to different kind of music to just get me get me going. Just uh, whatever music I'm, I'm enjoying in that moment. Entweder Musik hören oder ja, ein bisschen im Handy rum tippen noch. Musik hören. Ich mache mir Gedanken über das Spiel, über den Gegner und gehe nochmal alles durch. On my right side is Chupo and Thomas. I sit in the corner kind of. Uh, Rafa Guerrero is next to me on my left. Uh, Alexander. Yeah. And normally it's uh, Nus. On my left side is Jamal. Usually it's um, Minjay. And then it's the goalkeepers. Ich sitze neben Sven Ulreich. Manu Neuer und rechts yeah. Minjay. Neben mir sitzt Mata und Matisse. Ich denke, grundsätzlich braucht man immer ein bisschen Lockerheit und Konzentration. Before leading up to the game, obviously you need to be relaxed, you need to free your head. That's the best way to, to approach a game, to, so you can play better, because you, know, you don't want to put too much stress on yourself, you know, you don't want to overthink too much, that's when mistakes happen. Sobald das Aufwärmen startet in der Arena, bin ich schon sehr fokussiert. Fokussieren tue ich mich, wenn es eigentlich so ein bisschen zum Aufwärmen rausgeht. Spätestens dann, wenn wir aus dem Bus aussteigen. I remember one time someone said to me, uh, a player before, he said like, uh, you can't play the game before the game, you know? When we finish uh, to it, I just go in my room and think about uh, the game a little bit, but I uh, just, yeah, rest a little bit before leaving for the for the stadium. When I get into the changing room, then uh, I start to focus more and, and be a bit more serious. As soon as you get on the pitch, full focus. You know, you listen to the coach, you watch the videos beforehand, and you focus on what you need to do in the game. Yeah, Fonzie legt Musik auf. Yeah, so I am the DJ in the locker room. You know, I play, I play the music that gets us pumped up. Da ist von allem etwas dabei. I try not to stick to one genre of music. You know, I try to play everything so everyone can enjoy and everyone can be pumped. I have to make a playlist, you know, where everybody sends in their, their song request, and we just pull on repeat. Conny Leimer, I enjoy his humor. Uh, Thomas Muller is very lively as well. And then uh, uh, Fonzie. Overall, it's just it's good vibes. You know, when we come on the pitch, we try to play with, with energy, with aggression. Thomas Muller <laughs> sorgt noch für gute Stimmung. <laughs> Thomas Muller, I think, will be the good answer. Thomas Chupu. I don't have anyone here yet, but normally my wife. I just look out. In the crowd, if I have uh, friends and family, you know, in the in the stands, you know, I try to wave at them. My parents, if, if they if they're in the stadium, then uh, those who are, I I always try to find in in the stands. For my family, when they are in the stadium, when we play at night, sometimes they are not there because my kids are really young, and sometimes they have school the day after. Nach meiner Familie. Wenn meine Frau und meine Familie da ist, dann schaue ich uh, zu denen. My wife all the time when, uh, yeah, also if, if she's in the stadium, I just send one message. I say, yeah, I love you and think a, a lot about you. And yeah, we see you after the game. My wife or my mom? Meine Frau. Uh, meine Frau. Eigentlich uh, geht es nur darum, dass ich mich nach dem Spiel dann melde und uh, dass ich jetzt uh, die nächsten drei, vier Stunden nicht erreichbar bin und dass wir jetzt losgehen zum Spiel. With my mom, we always say the same, she always says the same thing to me and I always say the same thing back. With my wife, it just changes. Normally, uh, just ends with I love you, I, I think. <laughs> trying to get loose, trying to get as many touches on the ball as possible. Try to be, to be warm and uh, give everything uh, 
to be ready for, for the game after. During the game, you know, the ball moves very quickly and you don't have that much time to take so many touches. So I try to get a lot of touches on the ball, try to, you know, shoot. Nicht viel eigentlich, <laughs> eigentlich nur, dass ich ja warm, guten Rhythmus bekomme. Um, schau, okay. Wie wollen wir heute spielen? Taktik um, und ja, was eigentlich darauf auf uns zukommt. Keep the energy up, you know, keep the fitness up, you know. So when the game starts and you do that, sprint, that first sprint, you're not tired. Eigentlich so die Abläufe, um, was auf mich zukommen kann und versuche mich darauf fok uh, zu fokussieren und uh, versuche da ja, um, im Kopf dann klar zu sein. Just trying to, to get my body ready, more importantly uh, than anything. To warm up with a good intensity. Beim Aufwärmen haben wir einen, also einen ganz normalen Ablauf, der immer wieder kehrend ist, dass ich mir keine Gedanken machen muss und das ist eigentlich automatisiert. I always want to feel like I've had a good warm up because I think uh, it, it gives me a little bit of confidence going into the game. <lacht>